Rotating while cementing properly centralized casing is widely recognized by leading operators and cementing experts as best practice for preventing fluid migration and groundwater contamination. In horizontal wells, gelled mud and cuttings form a bed on the low side of the well bore. Without proper centralization, high drag forces are encountered while running casing. Additionally, the largest annular flow area is above the casing, where fluid velocities are the highest. This can result in the formation of a low side channel after cement has been displaced, which can facilitate fluid or gas migration. The first step in addressing this problem is improving casing standoff with proper centralization. This significantly reduces drag forces while running casing by minimizing wall contact with the low side mud and cutting spec. Centralization also improves annular fluid flow dynamics and virtually eliminates the possibility of differential sticking. However, fluid velocities remain highest above the casing as 100% standoff cannot be achieved with rigid centralizers in a horizontal well bore. The mud and cuttings bed on the low side of the well bore still present a significant risk of a channel forming and subsequent fluid or gas migration. Introducing casing rotation optimizes the process and is proven to be the most effective technique for cementing a horizontal well bore. By rotating the pipe, drag forces induced by the casing through the cement break up the gelled mud and cuttings bed. This process is called viscous coupling. Gelled mud and cuttings are pulled into the high velocity flow path above the casing and displaced from the well bore, while cement is simultaneously pulled to the low side of the hole. The end result? Any potential channeling is removed and replaced with clean, contaminant-free cement, which then provides optimized zonal isolation for frac operations.